Welcome to Sports Trades. My name is Lou, and in this edition of Built for the Playoffs, I will look into how Sam Presti constructed the roster for a small market Oklahoma City Thunder team to attempt a finals run. Once again, every trade, draft pick, free agent signing, waiver claim will be discussed as to how every player was acquired. Please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and of course, I hope you enjoy the video. With the fourth pick of the 2008 NBA Draft, the Seattle Supersonics selected Mr. Triple Double, Russell Westbrook from UCLA. James Harden was the third pick of the 2009 NBA Draft from Arizona State. June 25th, 1997, the Supersonics dealt the rights to Bobby Jackson, the 25th pick, for a player in a 1998 second round draft pick, later used by Rashard Lewis. July 11th, 2007, Rashard Lewis would be dealt in a signing trade with the Orlando Magic for a top 55 protected 2009 second round draft pick and $9 million trade exemption. Then nine days later, the Sonics took both of the pieces from the Orlando Magic and dealt them to the Phoenix Suns for a huge salary from Kurt Thomas and two first round draft picks for 2008 and 2010. Serge Ibaka, who I'll mention later, in the 2010 pick used on Quincy Pondexter. Pondexter would be dealt with Craig Bracken's draft rights, 21st overall to the Memphis Grizzlies for Morris Peterson and the draft rights to Cole Aldridge. Robert Vadden was acquired for cash during the 2009 NBA draft from the Charlotte Bobcats. He would be packaged with Oklahoma City's 2012 and 13 second round draft pick to the Minnesota Timberwolves for Lazar Hayward, December 13th, 2011. Johan Petro was the 25th pick of the 2005 NBA Draft. Packaged with their own 2009 second round draft pick, the Thunder acquired Chucky Atkins and a first round draft pick from Denver. Damian Wilkins signed as a free agent October 4th, 2004. He'd be packaged with Atkins July 27th, 2009 for Eaton Thomas and two second round draft picks, one being Dexter Pittman. The Heat clearing cap space to acquire LeBron James and Chris Bosh dealt Daquan Cook and the 18th pick of the 2010 NBA Draft for the 32nd pick later used on Dexter Pittman. October 27, 2012. The Oklahoma City Thunder decided they wanted to try their best impression of Mr. Krabs, Julius from Everybody Hates Chris, and Mort Goldman and deal away 27-2018 most valuable player James Harden after not wanting to give him a max contract. Cole Aldridge, Lazar Hayward, and Daquan Cook to the Houston Rockets for pieces. But one of them being the 2013 Toronto pick later used on Aquaman stunt double Steven Adams. He was the 12th pick of the 2013 NBA draft out of Pitt. This is just an extreme side note and the only time I may ever get to talk about this. So you mean to tell me that you get a high draft pick for the third year in a row? You get to use it on James Harden. What I never understood was Tabu Cephalosha starting the games. You drafted James Harden third overall. After you drafted Kevin Durant second overall, he was balling. Russell Westbrook was the fourth pick. He was balling. What I never understood was the whole picking a Baca over Harden thing. It's, oh, well, we don't value Harden. We don't think he's going to get you know that much better. He's just a sixth man. He was the third overall pick. And I don't know if in my Nets video that I called the Kevin Garnett, Paul Pierce deal, the worst trade of the century. He was also there for three years, you know, built a really close bond with KD and Westbrook. And then Sam Presti gives him one hour on a decision that would ultimately change his entire life. I don't, you know, I'm not going to knock James Harden for wanting more money. It's a business. One last thing before I continue on to the video. Clay Bennett, you are a billionaire. What the heck is a luxury tax to a billionaire? You cheapskate. June 27, 2013, the Oklahoma City Thunder dealt Archie Goodwin's draft rights to the Golden State Warriors for Andre Roberson. I already went over how the Supersonics got the draft pick for Serge Ibaka. During the 2016 NBA draft, he'd be dealt to the Orlando Magic 
for Victor Oladipo, Ersan Ilyasova, and the 11th pick on DeMontis Sabonis. Ersan Ilyasova would be dealt with a future 2020 first round draft pick to the Philadelphia 76ers for Jemiah Grant. With the 21st pick of the 2017 NBA Draft, the Oklahoma City Thunder selected Oklahoma-born Terrence Ferguson after he had played in South Australia. Remember the Serge Ibaka to Orlando deal that I mentioned? Well, they dealt Oladipo and Sabonis to the Indiana Pacers for Paul George. Fun fact, Paul George is the fourth player to wear 13 on Oklahoma City behind Chucky Atkins, James Harden, and Nazir Muhammad. July 10th, 2017, they signed Raymond Felton as a free agent who was previously on the Los Angeles Clippers. Same day, they signed Patrick Patterson, formerly on the Toronto Raptors. July 6th, 2018, they signed Deontay Burton to a two-way contract. On the same day, they flipped their own 2019 second round draft pick to the Charlotte Hornets for the rights to Hamadou Diallo, who later won the slam dunk contest in 2019. Also, July 6th, 2018, they signed former piece of the process, Neurons Noel, who was on the Mavericks the season before, and the only reason he was a free agent was because after receiving a four year, $70 million deal from Mark Cuban, he was like, nah. Dakari Johnson was the 48th pick of the 2015 NBA Draft. He'd be dealt with cash to Orlando for Rodney Purvis. Three days later, Purvis would be dealt to the Boston Celtics for 2016-17 D-League Rookie of the Year Abdel Nader and $450,000 cash. This is the longest active trade chain and maybe ever in the NBA. Jack Simka was the 8th pick of the 1977 NBA Draft and a part of the 1979 NBA Championship. July 1st, 1986, Sigma would be dealt to the Milwaukee Bucks along with a 1987 and 89 second round draft pick for Alton Lister. August 7th, 1989, Lister would be dealt to the non-super team Golden State Warriors to receive the Seattle 1990 first round draft pick, which obviously the Sonics gave to the Warriors in a previous trade. That doesn't matter to any of this chain. So the Sonics later would have the second overall pick, which they would use to select 1995-96 Defensive Player of the Year, the glove, Gary Payton. Desmond Mason was the 17th pick of the 2000 NBA Draft. Mason and Payton would be dealt to the Milwaukee Bucks for Ray Allen, two other players, and a draft pick. And Glenn Davis was the 35th pick of the 2007 NBA Draft. He would be packaged with Jesus Shuttlesworth for Jeff Green, two players, and a second round draft pick. Remember when Miami dumped Cook in the 18th pick for Dexter Pittman to acquire salary flexibility to get the big three? Well, OKC flipped the pick to the Clippers so that they could select Terry Rozier's son, Drew Bledsoe, and in exchange got a 2012 first round draft pick later used on Fab Mello, rest in peace. Nanad Christich was signed to a three-year deal as a restricted free agent from the New Jersey Nets December 30th, 2008. So Green, Christich, and the pick for Fab Mello would be dealt to the Boston Celtics for Kendrick Perkins and three-time slam dunk champion Nate Robinson. June 24, 2010, the Hawks sold the rights to Tibor Police to the Oklahoma City Thunder. Reggie Jackson was the 24th pick of the 2011 NBA Draft. June 27, 2013, Grant Jarrett was sold to the Oklahoma City Thunder by Portland. So Tibor, Jackson, Perkins, Grant, and OKC's first round draft pick of 2018 would be dealt to the Jazz and Pistons for Enos Cantor and other pieces. Ryan Gomes signed a one-year minimum deal August 7th, 2013. January 7th, 2014, he'd be dealt in a three-team deal with the Celtics and Grizzlies for a non-exercised 2014 second round draft pick, but the 49th overall pick of the 2017 NBA draft. August 30th, 2016, the 49th pick from Memphis and OKC's own second round draft pick for 2017 would be dealt to the Denver Nuggets for Joffrey Laverne. Anthony Morrill signed as a free agent July 16, 2014 after he was previously on the New Orleans Pelicans. Russell Westbrook's former dance buddy Cameron Payne was taken 14th overall in the 2015 NBA Draft. February 23, 2017, Morrill, Payne, and Joffrey would be dealt to the Chicago Bulls for Doug McDermott, Chicago's 2018 second round draft pick, and Todd Gibson, who is not a part of the chain. 
September 25th, 2017, McDermott, Chicago's 2018 second round draft pick, and Ennis Cantor would be shipped to the New York Knicks for Carmelo Anthony. July 25th, 2018, after Carmelo had a failure of a season and not taking a bench roll, he was yeeted to the Atlanta Hawks in a three-team deal with Philadelphia for Dennis Schroeder. February 20th, 2019, after being flipped for Wesley Johnson, the Pelicans cut Marcus Morris' twin brother, Markeith Morris, and Markeith Morris would later sign with the Oklahoma City Thunder. If you happen to enjoy the video, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. It helps the channel grow. Until next time, I'm Lou on Sports Trades. Peace out.